So my name is Alex Hearn, and I'm the MD and founder of Slipcase.com. So Slipcase is a central content platform for the global commercial sector of the industry. Uh, and it's really from two perspectives. From a user perspective, we're a really simple one-stop shop to get all the information you might need on a day-to-day -day basis. So brokers, underwriters, risk managers come to our platform. They pick relevant product lines of business. They pick interest areas like insure tech or financial results or market moves. Uh, they pick from companies that they deal with or could be dealing with uh, and their favorite publications. And we then pull throughout the day all the latest news and insights relevant to that individual and funnel it through to them to keep them up to date with what's going on. Uh, and from an organizational perspective, the other perspective, our client companies host pages on our platform and we've become a uniquely targeted way of broadcasting uh, an organization's brand, their expertise, and their latest news and insights to a relevant audience of global insurance and reinsurance professionals. So our customers are, on the user side, they are individual brokers, um, underwriters, risk managers, any employee from those organizations in the commercial sector of the industry. Uh, and on the organizational side, so our client side, our key users, our key clients are carriers who are producing great insights and thought leadership for the market, brokers who are doing the same, and then very closely related service providers who are generating value add information for our audience. So we try and solve uh, challenges from, again, both perspectives. From a user perspective, I was a broker uh, in the London market for a couple of years and found it very difficult to get hold of all the information that was relevant to me on a day-to-day -day basis. So I wanted to come up with a solution for that. And I think from a more senior perspective of the market, there was almost sort of a bombardment of information, too much out there, uh, too many email newsletters throughout the day. So really just making life easier for anyone, no matter where they are in the industry, to keep up to date with all the information that they need. And on the organizational side, I think the key issue we discovered was a lot of companies were producing really fantastic insights, information, thought leadership, non-salesy information that was really great information for the market, but they found it very difficult to get it in front of the right audiences within the industry. So our ambitions going forward are quite significant. We've doubled in size as a business the last two years in a row. Our user base has grown by 130% this year. We've grown by 300% in the US. It's a real focus for us. Uh, and we're about to release a new website based on a lot of user feedback, uh, an enhanced version of what we've already got, both on the front end and on the back end. So we're collecting more information, we're analyzing it more clearly, we're communicating it through to clients more efficiently. Uh, that's a, gonna be a big step for us going forward. We've also just built an API product, which I know is a very relevant theme uh, here. Um, and that enables us to plug in feeds into client companies. So if an organization wants a feed on InsureTech, we can provide them with an HTML code, they plug into their website, it keeps their employees up to date with all the latest InsureTech news from across the market. And that can be interest areas or specialty lines of business, whatever it might be. So uh, a bit of a variety from the technology side.